why are you supporting Mr. Roland Robert for President of United States? Well, I first of all, I've known Roland Roberts for several years and had the distinct privilege to travel with him overseas on what I would call complex uh, political diplomatic missions. And in every case, he was extremely well versed in the politics of each country. He knew many people. I was astounded how many people he actually knew knows overseas and how many countries he's visited. So from an international perspective, which is my personal passion, I served in Congress on the Foreign Affairs Committee and as you know, served representing the United States in the United Nations in New York. So this is a personal passion and to see a man like Roland Roberts with integrity, with character, that's extremely creative. He had been an entrepreneur, a successful business person. I mean, he, that's all these qualities are what we need in a world that's becoming more and more divided, more complex, and more violent. We need people of goodwill that can take initiative for peace. So in those various trips with him, I was quite impressed with him, Dr. Roberts, in all these areas. So you have spent quite a lot of time with Mr. Roland Roberts. So can you tell me about his ability to lead, his character and ability to unify a nation and world that is greatly divided? I don't know if anyone, I don't know what qualifications one would have to unite the United States alone. We are so, as you know, divided here. But he, as I said before, he's bright. Uh, he has a sense of compassion and mercy that I would say is severely lacking in most candidates, uh, particularly at either side, Republican or Democrat. I mean, everyone claims to be compassionate, but the, the rhetoric is so vitriolic it is so difficult and hard and cutting. And I would say Roland Roberts is a man who can speak softly, but firmly. And with delegations, he's able to lead effectively. I have observed from afar that he has brought delegations in from Africa and taken them to various state capitals. And he's able to coordinate, facilitate, and engage multicultural environments quite easily. It's like he was born in it. <laughs> so he has uh, unique, unique qualities that frankly are missing from most of the candidates in the race now. So what is your opinion on his likability factor and his policies? I support his policies. It's, besides his character, his ability to lead, his international prowess, his diplomatic capacities, and his, and his economic successes, he also has capacity to bring people together. And I've seen him do that with extraordinarily diverse and divided people groups especially overseas. If he can do it there, I'm sure he can do it here. And he has unique qualities of being a man of faith. He doesn't push it. He doesn't try to convert people. He simply lives it, which is probably the most effective way one can live their faith is by not wearing it. You know, we say in the United States, wearing it on your shirt cuff, like so everyone can see it. It's just inside of him. It's a natural instinct, spiritual instinctive quality. So uh, I would say he, he has the capacity to lead and he has the capacity to organize and to bring people together. And he has this uh, remarkable deep faith and he, sh he's, he lives it and shares it in a way that's not offensive to the diversities 
he's working with. So when choosing the next president of United States, what is the most important factor for you? And how does presidential candidate Mr. Roland Robert meet that expectation in your mind? Well, I think I've already outlined, you know, several of those particular factors, but his his program is unique because he's not just looking just to the economy. And, at, and as an economist and successful on, entrepreneur, one can have confidence that he'd have an ability to handle the economic matters better than some person who's been a politician all his life, such as their sitting president. Secondly, his, his character is strong enough and his leadership skills are also capable enough to bring diverse factions, factions together, Democrats and Republicans. He's able to create remarkable coalitions. Here it is, you ready? Mar remarkable coalitions of people to come up with a majority. For example, in his political campaign, okay, so he's conservative. And he talks a lot about God and freedom, yet he's not a bigot. He has black, white, brown, yellow, LGBTQ+. I mean, what Republican candidates can bring this kind of diversity into his organization? I mean, this is remarkable. He might be able to bring, okay, Christians. What about Buddhists? What about Muslims? What about minority groups? Oh, he's... He's obviously very white, as I am, but he's able, to my enthusiasm, bring diverse people together, because without that, the world will remain, America will remain in chaos. So at last, if I request you to sum up in one sentence, why should people vote for Mr. Roland Roberts as a president? They should vote for Roland Roberts because he has first a vision for America and that vision includes everyone in the United States not just a few people and that vision includes the economy the military it includes all international relations it includes all the critical aspects he's a man of faith and character and we won't have to worry in my view about dramas coming up, about payoffs and scandals. Wouldn't it be nice just to have a scandalous administration for once? <laughs>